Welcome to one of the most football crazy cities anywhere in Europe. We are in Dortmund, famed of course for the famous Yellow Wall. I'm Derek Ray and sharing commentary with me as usual is Stuart Robson. And we can't wait for this one to start with justifiable cause. It is Borussia Dortmund up against Aston Villa. Thanks, Derek. Well, often we talk about the tactics, the individual players, players that are missing, but so often it's the mentality of the players that is key to winning any football game. Which of these teams has the right attitude today is the big question. And a Dortmund corner here. Over it comes. Half-hearted clearance. That's the kind of shielding play you expect from him. This could be dangerous if he's not careful. The high press was on, and that's a fantastic tackle. And teammates to play it to. Well, he really is danger personified, but in this game, Stuart, what do you think we might see from him? Well, Derek, it's a great all round. And denied by the keeper. Impressive. <laughs> Played over. Emphasis on the clearance. A good one. Well, that's how to keep the opposition at bay. Good use of advantage there. Bailey. Played into the centre. Just wanted to get it out of there. Karim Adeyemi. Accepting it intelligently. Rogers. Here is Digne. Luca Dean. Moving the ball nicely, but can they forge ahead? Good physical play and good pressure high up the pitch. attack looks highly promising and there it is 1-0 the efforts have been rewarded and look at the celebrations well here it is again and it's all about the pace on the counter attack they were so quick to break out from their defensive positions but should the keeper be beaten at his near post i don't think so he really needs to do better in those situations where Unai Emery has to show his quality how can he affect the game and get his team back into this so underway again here 1-0 the score John McGinn it's a weighted pass this could square the game timely intervention Giving it a real go in the wide area. And crossing towards the far post. Well, pretty straightforward for the keeper, you've got to say. Schlotterbeck. Brandt. Nicolo Zaniolo on the ball Zaniolo 
Well, they're moving it around with real purpose here. McGinn. And now Bailey. And he takes on the shot. And a goal to level this contest. All even. Well, here's another look. And you can see what a good finish this is. He holds off the defender brilliantly and keeps his composure. That's a great goal. So, a level contest. 1-1. One, one. Mecha. Good technique displayed. Well, possibilities in the centre. And a good challenge to bring that attack to an end. Cuts in from the flank. Karim Adeyemi. Felix Mecha. Brandt. Oh, great block. Could be a chance to break here. One minute of stoppage time has been added on. And pulled back. And it's a double for him in this game. No way for the opposition to contain him. And no wonder he's off celebrating. Well, here's the replay. He's done really well to get his head up and pick somebody out with that cutback. And the movement is good, making for a comfortable finish. It's a really great goal. The referee's whistle, and so the first half has come to an end here at the Zignal Iduna Park. The second half restart here at the home of Borussia Dortmund. Bailey. Really fine piece of defending play to break us up. This could level it. Oh, but the keeper with an important save. How important is that? Well, he should score from there. That's a wasted opportunity. He should beat the keeper from that sort of distance. Substitution it is for Dortmund. Continues his run, and this to level it. And the keeper had plenty to think about with bodies around him. Watkins. Villa unable to retain possession. Plenty of support here. players waiting in the middle Grant and that was goalkeeping right out of the top drawer it's absolutely remarkable his reflexes were brilliant there and there's the delivery Cleared away. Nico Schlotterbeck. Brandt. Well, it's 
supporters think it's on. Well, he tried to place that one, and given his proximity to the goal, he's bound to be disappointed. Well, they've decided to make a change. That's a very fine piece of tackling. As you can see, Dortmund have controlled the possession in the last 15 minutes and have been really positive with it. They're creating opportunities and it's surely only a matter of time before they draw level here. Now can they win back possession and create something else? Tielemans. That they look as though they want to make this move count. Determined defending. Brandt. A real opening now. Well, well, well. How many players would have the confidence to try that? Simply magnificent. Well, as you can see, that's a wonderful finish. He just sees the keeper off his line and lifts it open. That was a great bit of skill. Again here, this has been quite the roller coaster ride. Niklas Zule, and the ball is with Girassi. Pascal Gross. This could be troublesome. Electing to shoot. Oh, great block. Can they hit on the break? Tielemans. Here's Bailey. He takes aim. Well, somehow the goalkeeper got to it. And Dortmund will go to the bench. How about the short corner? Delivering it into the box. Well, a bit short with the clearance. Can they convert? What an important piece of defending. And time for the change now. Over it comes. Clearance left a bit to be desired. Douglas Luiz. And with that, the attack fizzles out. Only five minutes left for play, and tension galore with the teams locked together. Well, they might be able to launch a counter attack. And the goalkeeper has outdone himself with that save time it is here <laughs> trying to pick out a teammate aerial opportunity couldn't take it well he did well to get to the ball first and he's unlucky there he just got too much on it Douglas Luiz and Cash with it John McGinn 
And a goal at this stage might well turn out to be decisive. And that is offside. Tielemans. Douglas Luiz. And threading it through. And the teams are level. And every corner counts at this juncture. And there's the delivery. Not the best clearance. And the attack fizzling out. They cannot be separated here, and it's on to extra time. And this will test the mentality of any footballer. Well, the keeper reacted magnificently. Superb placement there. Mental preparation is such a big part of this. In it goes! And that's how to take a penalty. Low and into the back of the net. He's gone for the Panenka, but he might be wishing he hadn't. So lethal in front of goal. And so the tension levels have been ratcheted up to full blast. Job done from the spot. Well, it comes down to this. In, and they win. Well, that was the so-called Panenka, but when it doesn't work out, oh dear. And it's gone in. A goal here to finish it. Directly into the goalkeeper's arms. Low and accurate, that penalty. Composure is so important under these trying circumstances. Clinical, as always, in front of goal. Can he convert? That is the moment he would like to airbrush from history. It comes down to this, a goal, and they win the game. Engulfed by all the pressure, he nevertheless puts it away to win this penalty shootout. Well, it's a good penalty. He showed a lot of composure there, and overall, they probably just about deserve to win this game.